How did I come to costume design as a career? I always loved making things as a child. My godmother was a children's dress designer. Uh, my mother would take me up to London to see the theater and I thought that was the most magical thing in the world. You went into these jewel boxes and then the curtains opened and you were taken and transported into another world. So I'm one of those odd people who always knew this is what I wanted to do. In between cutting up fabric and my parents' clothes and making outfits for my teddy bear that generally weren't fashion. Uh, fashion felt a little too rigid for me. Storytelling and clothing and costumes through storytelling were just something that always fascinated me. I went to art school in England. I did two years of uh, foundation in art and then specialized for three years in set and costume design and lighting uh, with a focus on costume design. When I was at art school, I had an amazing, very fastidious, rather annoying um, tutor by the name of Stephen Doncaster. And he said to me, child, start always with what's on the page. And for some reason, for all of us when we're training, um, and even after we leave college, uh, there are certain things that stick. And that always stuck with me. Research for me is, is the backbone. And diving into that world, whether it's starting with what Shakespeare's told me about a character on the page, uh, whether it's going to old photographs, old journals, researching how fabrics were made and dyed and put together. For me, that's 